Hey babies, it's Joy Navon and welcome to my living room. I'm not even going to sit here and tell you guys how many times I've tried to film this video, but here we are. If you are new here, hi, hello, I am Joy. Thank you so much for clicking on today's video. You guys, there is so much noise happening outside my window today and I don't know why. It's a Monday afternoon, so what is that about? Anyway, hopefully we are not interrupted furthermore and we can go ahead and jump into the video. Let's go. So I feel like the best way to start this off is by talking about the couch. It is absolutely my dream couch if I'm just trying so hard not to be dramatic. I knew for the longest time that I wanted a brown leather couch and my husband and I before moving here already had in mind the exact couch that we wanted. We wanted the Linux sofa, I believe it's called, from CB2. She is very expensive and this couch is from Article Furniture and it just so happened to be the perfect dupe. It's like half the price and a very, very similar style. I will be linking every single thing that I'm like talking about or showing you guys that I can in the description box, which is a lot. Um, and thankfully there's a lot of items that are still available. So if you're interested in something, I would highly suggest you like jump on it. This was like the perfect compromise and i'm so happy that we have it it's so comfy we sit here every single day watch movies cuddle up we have our throw blankets on here our throw pillows these pillows are actually from home goods and home sense this throw is actually from amazon one of my favorite items that we have in the apartment period okay so welcome to my favorite corner of the apartment it's just very like fun and bright and colorful but still neutral to me in some type of way if i had to say something that i was asked about most in this living room it would definitely be our art prints so if you've ever heard of the moma museum here in New York City, then you might know that they have a store. So it's called the MoMA Design Store and they actually sell these prints just like this. People tend to also ask me if I ever got them framed. Where did I go? They already come like this. They have so many like different styles and designs and I'm just absolutely obsessed. The first one, this red one, is actually a gift that I got my husband for his birthday. Um, we both absolutely love Basquiat. He is our favorite artist of all time. I myself am from Brooklyn and I just always, always loved Basquiat. And so I knew I wanted to have something in here that represented him. And so it was just a little birthday gift for the both of us technically, but he absolutely loved it. And when we hung it up in here, we realized how small it felt because our apartment has very, very tall ceilings. These are like, I don't even know, like eight foot, nine foot ceilings or something. And so it just completely got swallowed up on the wall. And I was like, you know what, let's get more. So we went and got more. And now we have our own entire Basquiat wall. little situation right here is my absolute pride and joy it's my like center of happiness I have to say because I work from home so I wanted to make sure that I had some type of like office nook area to work um, and like edit videos edit content I am a full-time content creator so it was important that I have like a safe space i have some like baskets over here i have like a little ikea drawer system um i have just a lot to so pr packages like so many things that i just kind of like hide and throw equipment away at but it looks really cute <laughs> in my opinion and you would never know unless i told you so now you know. This shelf situation came about 
very naturally and very randomly. I am a huge music lover and so is my husband. We have a lot of vinyls and books and plants, obviously. So I knew that I wanted to have shelves over here for this nook. But other than that, I didn't honestly know what I wanted to put on it. But Kendrick Lamar is my favorite artist of all time. So there's a lot of Kendrick Lamar over here. Like I have all of his albums. Internet is one of my favorite bands. Lucky Day is up there. Viola Davis is just Viola Davis. And so I just knew that I wanted to like play with colors. I wanted to like coordinate things. This shelf has actually changed a little bit, like maybe like three times, three, four times in the only eight months that we've been here. But I love how it turned out now and I've just been keeping it this way, but it'll probably change again. I went on vacation, my husband and I, and we stopped in a crate and barrel store. Saw this chair, the same exact chair, fell in love with it. I took pictures in it. I videos like foaming at the mouth basically over this chair fell in love and almost like a year to the day we got approved for our apartment and so we went like furniture shopping browsing and we went to the crate and barrel outlet and saw this exact chair my husband actually remembered the chair immediately i didn't remember it um we left the store i just so happened to like be cleaning out my camera roll of my phone that day and i saw the pictures and the videos that I took in this same exact chair. Um, and I was like, oh my God, that's the chair. So we literally had to go back, go back to the store and buy the chair. The chair was so cheap. Also, it was like 60% off of the original price and it was just a complete steal. But when I looked at the date of the photos and the videos, it was literally like a year to the day. <laughs> so. It was a complete manifestation that I didn't even realize I I did, but now I could never get rid of it. I'm so thankful and so happy to have it. Like it's so comfy too. So I have to talk about our coffee table. I am obsessed with this table and we completely finessed it for, I want to say a little over a hundred dollars. If you guys are interested in the actual DIY video of us putting this together, please just let me know. Coffee table books are super important to me. So we have a lot of them, a lot of them not even on the coffee table, but like in our credenza. But this book is the book that we picked up from the Virgil exhibit. Um, I believe that was at the Brooklyn Museum. But my favorite book on the table would definitely have to be our Michael Jackson on the wall book. It's just such a special book. It's super insightful and creative and you just get a really cool look at all of the art that was done inspired by Michael. And as huge art enthusiasts, art geeks, photography obsessed people, um, we just love this book. <laughs> So like I said, this is a smaller apartment, so I really wanted to get creative and create dedicated spaces for our living situation. This is a completely open concept apartment though, so it's like our dining situation and our kitchen is right next to this. So I wanted to like pull everything over here and hone in on entertainment. All of the shelves in our apartment are from Ikea. And again, with the vinyls and the books and the plants, it was just very important to me to like showcase black art and like our culture and things that we absolutely love. I don't know, we're connected to every single thing that you see here in some type of way. This credenza is so cool because not only does it look really cool and not only is it like just a statement piece within itself but this was another crate and barrel outlet find um i don't even somehow some way everything in here wound up being from crate and barrel and that, that is like a dream come true for me because if you know anything about that store it is very expensive but somehow some way we have very expensive taste but we did not wind up having to pay very expensive prices <laughs> so 
it might look very expensive in here but it was not we did not have to pay for it in that way and i'm so thankful it is actually a design in collaboration with cb2 and lenny kravitz and i did not even know that until after we bought it so i just feel very lucky and very grateful to have this in our space because not only is it just really cool looking and a statement piece and very well made but it's in collaboration with Lenny Kravitz, like how cool is that? Okay, I had to close the door because our bedroom is not quite finished yet. That's going to be a totally different video. But the last thing I wanted to talk about was this piece of art here because my husband and I actually made it. We went to a art class for date night, which is very us. And we actually got to make this. So it was just super cool, super special to be able to take this home and have this in our space now. We purposefully chose colors that we knew would work in here because we were like almost finished designing the space and it just turned out perfect. So I just want to encourage you guys to actually use things in your home and purchase things in your home that like mean something to you. I feel like that's the best way to design a space. I tend to get asked a lot now how I create like a curated space or like how do I tie everything together and like that's just how I feel like it automatically happens it usually just winds up working out <laughs> in the end all right you guys that was it I hope you all enjoyed every nook and cranny of my space that I could share hopefully I captured everything that you might have had questions about or that you were interested about or that you liked a lot um and please go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it it really helps out my channel make sure you follow me on all social media platforms at join avon i am literally the same on everything and i'm trying to be as consistent as possible on everything until then i will just have to see you guys next time bye